Operation Plan 33. Welcome back to another Bit Legend video. That's right, boys. We are doing Elimination Battle. Number 33, and it is the Apostle. So, ally speed, my speed's gonna go down by 15%. That might be significant. Um, I've got a fairly speedy team, and so it's very nice for them to get their hits off first, but that might not be the case in this one. Enemy crit plus 15, that is actually moderately scary. Um, enemy diversion plus 10%, even more so scary. When enemy takes fatal damage for the first time, it's gonna heal up to 30%, which that definitely sucks. And when the battle starts, um, 10 SP of all allies will be reduced. I'm going to lose SP. So this is probably going to be brutal. Let's go and do it. I'm um, looking at the team. Bum, 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 bum. What do I want? Hmm. Speed. No, 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 no. I'm probably going to need some more healing. I don't know why I backed out of that window. Um, Gosla Croc does not do heals. He has a 1 SP heal. All but he it's a horrible percentage and he's in here for snipe maybe I'll do Pharaoh and I'll have two guys sniping three guys sniping is really what I want though I want the snipe let's try it let's do it Gosler is still I press the button let's go all right um, Gosler is still plus five and I need to get working on him but I'm spending all my energy over here doing elim um, hmm. map is not looking great we're gonna make a break for it. Didn't, didn't get it, didn't get it. So let's see how bad all this stuff is. We got a lot of deflect. I am moderately scared of that. Let me get the volume down a little bit. Um, I swear I never put the volume up, but every time I start a video, I gotta, oof. And yeah, you're starting to see it. You are starting to see it. Um, that was a little bit scary. Little bit scary. And the boss is Apostle. Um, these guys are hitting hard, man. I should have brought more healers, and this is a mistake. <clears throat> Hopefully, I will get some procs. Look at Pioneer. That's a Pioneer plus zero, putting in big hits, doing big things. That's why he is on the team. Hopefully, we'll level up soon. Um, I am slowly closing in on getting to... I don't want to fight another one of those. Level 150, we're trying to get that other amplifier locked out. Can I sneak? Ah, oh, I just can't sneak these guys. He was looking away, not that that matters. Um, this might be a very quick video. Yeah, heal pet, that's what I'm talking about. So bang. If that was deflected, I would have been dead. I need to figure out what I'm gonna do about that. Hmm. Well, we're getting through. We're doing things. We're doing things. It's going well. Trying to find that boss. Trying to level up too. Peeking, peeking. I love that you can sneak past enemies. I like that ever so much. I think it really adds to uh, the whole thing. There is the boss. We have found him. Oh, I'm very happy. <laughs> So enemy has 15% crit and I'm losing speed and they also have the diversion. So very, very um, scary situation because I want to snipe out the enemies. However, if I use strong snipe skills and they get deflected, I freaking die a horrible, horrible death. And I don't know. So there was a reflect right there. So that kind of proved, I had a theory that you couldn't um, reflect a one SP attack all skills. But there was a reflect right there. It just doesn't do a ton of damage, so it's hard to notice. Um, you can tell I'm very apprehensive of getting deflected here, which is what you want. You want a, you want some sort of um, bonus that makes you think about it. And honestly, if a if a turn-based mobile MMO, not MMO, but turn-based mobile game can like terrify you at the level that this is terrifying me. Um, I mean, that's, there's something good there. That's pretty impressive. Let's throw a potion on there. Some of you guys don't know that you can buy a potion if you don't have any, um, and you can do that. And I'm gonna hit that button to see, okay, so obviously I can't potion final. 
So I'm going to swap my team around ever so slightly, and hopefully it'll be significant. And let's continue, because this is still winnable. It's, it's going to be difficult, but you get it. I'm kind of thinking about throwing these big skills out there just to, um, I don't know. Let's, let's try to take the healer out. I'm, I'm getting tempted by doing dumb things. And the deflect kill right there. Ooh, that's what potions are for, fellas. That's what potions are for. Oh, feels bad. Feels bad. Pioneer, going to throw that big heal, even though his crit damage bonus does nothing. Um, those big heals are beautiful. All right, got another one out. Got another one out. This is going. It's happening. And I can't potion him. So... Let's just let's continue. Please don't deflect that. Ooh, that was a 2 SP attack for the skill. All right. Two guys are out. Cannot potion them. We are on Pioneer right now. When you look at potions and you go back, the little I indicator over the head um, does go away. I, I'm i going to do the heal. We're going to waste a little bit of value on it, but I just, you know, anything can happen. Pet proc healing. Finally doing something. Can we keep going? All right. Potion. It's still doable, boys. This is still a winnable fight. Um, we're going to rotate there. I don't think that really matters too much. Kabang. Come on. I'm going to I'm gonna do the healing. That might have been a mistake right there. Kind of feels like that was a mistake. And I'm going to do the potion. Last time I was trying to do something like this, um, it just it didn't work out. We, we, it was bad times. Do I want to potion him, though? You know what? I will. Usually I like to wait until they die because I've only got two people remaining on the team. It's just too risky. Um... What's the damage value on this? Target, so 144 to 216. Um, let's just do that, and, I, and I'll keep the SP if I need to heal next turn. The bang. That absorb was so crucial, so critical. Come on, fellas. Dude, this is it. I was just checking for potions. Oh, it was the heal. That was the, when they're gonna die, they heal to 30%. All right, boys. You and me, mano a mano. Oh, come on. This is winnable, look at those. Yeah, get dodged, boy, get dodged. Get dodged. <laughs> Boss down. It would be so cool if we leveled up right now. Five XP. <laughs> we were 5 XP from leveling up. Whew. So, the old QB sneak, you sneak the boss, and then there you go. Let's go autopilot into trash and die and get in, and collect our loot. Um, the only thing I'm missing from dying to trash after is I'm going to miss out on the experience of killing these guys. They drop a little bit of gold, um, some guild currency, but I got no complaints. Actually, I wonder if I can play this and beat it. I'm not going to manual the entire... Um, Maybe Autopilot will do it. Let's step in here. Let's step in here for a second. If I get the XP and I level up, that'll just be cool. cool factor. Look at that. I'm telling you, tanking is the more difficult road. I get it. I've said it myself. However, I'm going to make it work. I'm going to make it work, fellas. We're going to do it. I honestly was worried that I wouldn't be able to do Hell Mode and Elimination. And here we are. Here we are, procking our heal pet. Dealing the things, Kung Fu Master. Look at that. Look at that. Hmm. Come on. Bang. Um, that was his little healing thing. I'm going to do the mount skill just because it's flashy. And then kaboom, grats to Vuk Life for getting the necklace in World Boss 7. That is pretty cool. And look at that. I did more damage than everybody on the team. Did we not level up? Did I do the math wrong? Oh, my goodness. I did math wrong. I thought I was five away, but whatever. I'm getting that corona brain where you've been in the house for too long. Let's just see what autopilot can do. Let's get the heck out of here. We did the job. Let me check on the time. Uh, we've only been going for nine minutes. I'm cool with that. <clears throat> so that was a potentially very, very difficult flag. And also, um, if I can do it as a tank, you guys can do it as, uh, with whatever builds that you're running. My fam team, I've got the moon plus 10. Final Mech plus 10, um, Pioneer plus 0, and Gossler plus 5. 
and I feel like that is a reasonable, attainable um, thing for you guys to go for. But I'm still one blueprint away from making full armored mech. I'm still one blueprint away from making sword man, and I'll probably just stop talking about um, those guys until I actually go and do it, because you're probably tired of hearing it. <sighs> okay, now we are five XP away. Or is there some sort of bug there? Is something going on? What's the deal? Dude, this is baller. I think the bigger flex is me um, soloing all these. <laughs> yeah. I need, just imagine this build with more diversion. Because I'm going to get more diversion. We're going to get more reflex. It's going to happen. So, y'all are getting sustained in the face. <laughs> the tank build's coming. I didn't lose face. Many other tanks have actually uh, private messaged me and said, hey, man, I'm thinking about... Um, I'm thinking about going DPS, man, tank is rough, and so on and so forth. And I'd say, if you're free to play, I still, I'm still going to continue pushing players to play DPS, um, because I, I do think it's easier and, and your bonuses are less critical, um, and you can get further in the game. Hey, we leveled up. But, um, for those of you that are going to stay the course, and I don't want to make you feel like, um, you know, you can't be free to play and be tank, you just might need to get a little bit of luck on your loot. Yeah, stay the course. You can do it. I can do it. We can do it. Operation Plan 33 complete. Over and out. As always, I appreciate you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video.